If there are elephants here, though, there must be a watering hole nearby. Just the sort of place for giant edible bullfrogs. Go have a look at this. You can see through the grass. And these bullfrogs are the biggest frogs in southern Africa. But all of the frogs down here are edible, but they do protect themselves. And, you know, some frogs will, like, secrete this poison off the back to deter predators, but this guy's got these big, like, lower teeth. So I don't want to just try and grab him. I'll end up getting bit by him. But I know what I can do to get him on him. I'm using a branch from a wait a while bush. Get caught on this, and that's just what you'll be doing. Rhodesian Special Forces use this to snare their prisoners and stop them escaping. Hopefully, it will work on my bullfrog. If I can keep up right. Where the hell's he gone? Oh, it stinks. It's got a surface somewhere. Oh, there he is. See him over there? Oh, it's a slippery one, this frog. Oh, there he is. There we go, we got him. And once he's on that wait a bit bush, he's not going to get off it. Cool. And that's dinner. And then go get some firewood. And there's plenty of that out here. And let you see what I mean by his teeth. Have a look in there. Don't want to get bit by those. OK, let's have some frog's legs. You don't want to eat the skin of these, but the meat inside is good, so what I'm going to do is just kind of kebab it. And what that will do is then burn all of the skin off and leave me with the meat underneath. And, yeah, you, you can also eat the... Eat the breast meat off that as well. Yeah, there's actually quite a good bit on here. I always like to start with some legs. One thing about being out in the bush like this is that it's actually very hard to ever switch off. You know, even when you've got a fire and something to eat, and every bone in your body kind of wants to just to relax and stop. But you can't hear, you know, you've no idea what animals are lurking in these grasses and you just need to keep your senses alert. And these look done now. Let's try a bit of this meat. Well, if you're French, you'd love this. But it kind of tastes a bit dirty, really. But it's a boost for my next challenge.